My name is John and I'm a professor slash tutor in the social sciences at Quest University Canada in Squamish, BC. We are on the unceded traditional and ancestral territory of the Chanoth people and particularly the Tlaoukouyat First Nation. Uh, it's a blessing to be here on your territory to be able to learn and experience this wonderful place. Thank you for having us. We're here in Tofino in the Clockwood Sound UNESCO Biosphere Reserve for part of a field course about political ecology, which is an upper division level social science course at Quest. The goal of the course is to use place-based learning and conversations with others to help students understand the complex dynamics that shape the socio-ecological environments of Clockwood Sound and the environmental politics and policies of this area. One of the parts of this course is that there's a level of intensity before the trip itself that allows you to get the theoretical underpinnings to explore this trip in a more critical way. Not having other classes allowed for that rigor on the front end and then of course on the back end not having to worry about any other classes and being able to leave campus for 10 days makes it possible to do a trip like this and to be flexible too, to add days on, to take days off, made this trip I think even richer than uh, any of us could have imagined at the beginning. It is the block plan that makes this kind of flexible pedagogic arrangement possible. That means that I can take students out of the classroom and come to a place like Tofino or Clackwood Sound for 10 days to experience firsthand the kind of things we might otherwise just read about in books. Watching them work in the classroom, you could see people starting to understand the ideas they were working with as a set of tools, but coming out here into the sound, you get to see people become proficient at using the ideas to make sense of the environments that they find themselves in. You're so engaged through having to come to a place and meet people who are involved in the issues that you're learning about and ask questions and hear stories and I think it's so much more involved than sitting in the classroom and it's a way to actually take what you're learning in school and see how it applies to everyday lives. I think it's the best way to learn.